And we are back. Hello, everybody. So next up, we're going to be taking a look at uh, Legacy Evolution Armada Hotshot. And I'm going to say this right off the bat. This is easily the best Armada Hotshot figure we have ever gotten. The original toy is kind of crappy. And the universe toy is vile. I won't be comparing it to either two because I don't own... I don't own the Armada Hotshot anymore, and I never own the Universe one because I've heard of how bad it is. So, we're just going to talk about this figure by itself. And I do like the vehicle mode. Um, he actually does have a spot for Jolt right up here, which um, they are repainting him into the um, Power Links version, which is going to come with Jolt. So I might get that just for Jolt. But he can actually still do the whole engine block gimmick. And if you really wanted to fully replicate it, you could open these up. But he doesn't have the buzz saws there anymore. We'll have to kind of give the effect. But it's a nice looking car mode. Um, I don't know what kind of car it is. But I think he's a nice looking car. He rolls fairly well. And yeah, there you go. He's a nice car mode. What can I say? So now let's talk about the transformation. So, we're going to start off by opening the doors. Opening the legs up. Pulling these pieces up. And then we're going to straighten out the legs. Like that. And these are going to fold into the back of the feet. Or the legs, rather. So, we're going to turn that all around. Boom. Boom, boom. And then we're going to rotate the waist and fold the feet out, turn his arms, like that, fold that piece back, open these pieces up, fold that piece down, open his chest up, fold out the head, and then just put these pieces on there. There you go, Armada Hotshot in his robot mode, and this, like I said before, this is leaps and bounds better than any hot shot we've ever gotten. And that's not me saying this figure is amazing, because he's pretty much just kind of okay. But compared to every other hot shot, this guy's, this guy's great in terms of other hot shots. But um, he has a waist swivel right there. They can go forward, they can go back, in and out, turn up here, knee, ankle. His head can turn, but because of the shoulders, he can't really look. Bicep, elbow, shoulders, forward, back. So he's got a decent range of articulation. He can hold his gun. Unfortunately, you can't plug the, the gun into the chest anymore. I wish you could, but you can't. He can still do the whole uh, bazooka gimmick with the... The visor. Um, and you can, if you want to, you can slide this off. And you can plug it into there. And honestly, I forgot how this works. I don't do it often. But... <laughs> And then you can just kind of have him hold a big bazooka. Um, okay, sure. <laughs> sure, why not? That's a little, um, it's a little strange. But you can do it. Now, something you can do, which I honestly highly recommend doing, is if you have our Armada Starscream, which I do. You get our Armada Starscream. And as you can see, Deluxe Voyager, so Starscream's bigger. You can give him the Star Saber, which I think works so much better for Hotshot than it does for Starscream. And you know, while we're here, now that we've got, now that I've reviewed all of them, let's take a group shot of all 
of the Armada guys so far. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, you I don't know what you guys just saw. But anyway. Now that this is my this is part of my childhood reincarnated. Um the only things that would make my inner child explode even further is um those Beast Wars 2 packs that are coming out. I'm going to be getting those and I will review them when I get them. But this is screaming to my nostalgia for sure because I have a lot of love for Armada. I know it's not a great show, but it was a very, very important, uh, pivotal part of my childhood. So I'm happy that we're getting Unicron Trilogy figures. It's really cool and it's making me really happy. <laughs> I hope we get Tidal Wave, Jetfire. But I also want characters like uh, Blur and Cyclonus, uh, Demolisher. Red Alert, uh, Smokescreen, Scavenger, uh, Thrust, Sideways. There are a lot of characters from the Unicron trilogy I would want. Hey, hell, give me an Armada Unicron. But I'm happy with the collection so far. Um, Hotshots, again, he's just... I like him, but he's not amazing. He's not mind-blowing. If I were to rank these guys, it would go Starscream, then Hotshot, then Megatron, then Prime at the top. Which is actually almost the uh, size accuracy. But, regardless. Um, I really like um, this, this collection so far. And Hotshot really does help complete it. Because he was a very pivotal character in Armada. Um, arguably, besides Prime, he was probably the, uh, the most important Autobot. So, in that respect, I'm glad he's here. Hopefully we get more. I definitely at least want Jetfire. Because I feel like that would be weird if they didn't do him. But we'll see. But until we get there, I want to thank you guys so much for watching this. I hope you enjoyed it. Stick around. We'll be back for more soon. Take care.